Hello guys, welcome back to another video. So I am in London, as always, as we always know, mainly vlog whenever I'm in London. Uh, yeah, so I've just arrived in London and I'm actually meeting Bronwyn, which is so exciting. So for anyone that doesn't know, I went to Uni of Bronwyn. She's in a lot of my um, old uni vlogs and stuff like that. But we unfortunately haven't been able to see each other for like a year because plans just didn't ever work out and we were working at different jobs at the time and like different hours and it was just a mess. We could never organize time, but then her hours changed, my job changed, my hours changed. So it turns out that actually we've both been getting Sundays off. So now it is currently a Sunday and we are meeting in London and we decided that we were gonna try and get some today ticks and we gave three top options. We got our first option. So we're going to see Back to the Future, which I'm so excited about because it's supposed to be incredible. My friend Sarah uh, went to go see it and she said it was insane but that it's hell a lot of money. But we got them on today ticks and we got 25 pound tickets, right? And we're sat row C in the stall's center. Like I looked it up, they're supposed to be 110 pound normally. So like we thrived. So very weird, but like I just got told to stop vlogging or asked why I was vlogging by some security man, which is why the clip suddenly stopped. I just said, oh, I just make YouTube content. And he was like, that's fine, you can carry on. It was a bit strange. But yes, so I'm on my way to meet Bronwyn. Um, she doesn't get in for about another half an hour to an hour now, um, just because of delays and missing trains and stuff like that. So I am just gonna go for a nice stroll. So as a lot of you know, I kind of worked out that I can walk from Waterloo Station into central London quite easily. So I'm gonna do that today. I do have a tube ticket, but I thought, why not? I might as well go for the walk if I've got the time. So I'm gonna go on a nice little stroll through London. I actually just love walking through London in this heat, like it's so nice, like everyone always hates London when it's like this hot, this busy, this stuffy, but I always try and walk over this bridge every time I'm in London because I just love walking across this bridge, like you have the, the London Eye, you have the Big Ben, like you've got the river, like you've got boats in the river, like it's just beautiful, like look at that, look at that, like you can't complain can you, um, and especially since it's so quick, like literally 10, 15 minutes I'm in the center. I mean, it normally takes me about 20 because I'm still like taking fit photos and like TikTok reels and all that kind of stuff. Whilst we're on that note, go and follow me on all my social platforms. So my Instagram is Callum136 and then my TikTok is actually Callum Smith1367 um, because I created an old account, didn't use it and then made a new one and I couldn't obviously have Callum136 because I'd already used it and I couldn't get into my old account. So that's what we're doing. Yeah, go give me a follow. And look at this lovely view. Loving life, loving life. Um, so Bronwyn should be actually now about half an hour away. Um, it was a lot sooner than we thought because she's gonna be getting off at Embankment instead of Victoria. Um, and she's getting a direct tube, so it's actually gonna make it quicker for her. So hopefully it shouldn't be too long. We can grab a little drink or something before we go and see Back to the Future, which I'm very excited. If you've watched the movie, I've heard it's very much like the movie um, and all the costumes look insane. I love the 80s and obviously it's set in the 80s, so absolutely buzzing for that. Love 80s music and apparently it's got 80s music vibes in it because obviously it's got an original soundtrack plus I believe two of the tracks from the movie. Um, so I'm very, very excited for that. But yeah, so it was a mad decision and I probably wouldn't get to see it if I didn't get it on Rush because I wouldn't pay that much money for it. So I'm very, very excited. Um, to see it and yeah just buzzing feeling good having a good day good vibes you know hope you're all well hope you're having a good day let me know in the comments what you're getting up to on your weekends at the moment how are you spending them and i will catch up again with you when i'm with Bronwyn. I'm actually just outside Embankment now. I'm very early. I forget that Embankment's even closer than getting into like the central London part. So I'm just gonna go chill. There's a nice little park there, so I'm gonna go have a little walk around the park and then hopefully Bronwyn will be in in like the next 10, 15 minutes or so.
Hello guys, Bronwyn is here. I've realised I haven't vlogged since Bronwyn's been here because we've just been talking and then we went straight into the show. But yes, sir. what did you think of the show? If you get the chance to go and watch it, watch it. Oh my god, god. Try today text because to use the plane So basically, <laughs> I, I kind of explained it already, but obviously I got the rush tickets for £25. Yes. We ended up in, I didn't realise, but as I was on the, after I'd met Roman, I looked at it and it said, you're in the muck fly zone. We were like, what do you mean? And obviously I don't want to spoil it, just in case there's people out there that are going to go, but it's, it's flying. Oh, it's pretty cool. Yes. It's yes. pretty damn cool. Like it's worth the, <laughs> it, I can see why the tickets are normally so expensive, but I'm also glad that we got them for £25 yes. because <laughs> epic. That was, it was a steal. <laughs> And Absolutely. It was so good. And the person who played Doc, we had his very first ever performance, which was sick. That, you wouldn't so think cool. it was his first performance nah, at all. That man it. knows how to do his job. Honestly, it was knows. so, so good. But yeah, what would you give out of 10? 10. Honestly, I'm sorry, the solid. lights. Solid. Oh, everything. How detailed the sets are. And the one liners that are from the movie, even I knew the one liners from the movie. Like, yeah, yeah, I'm not yeah. a mass fan of the movie. Like, I do know the movie, yeah. but like, I recognize the one liners. And then Absolutely. they have obviously the two songs that are from the movie. It was epic. Yes. It was so, so good. So, oh. go and watch it if you get the chance. We're now going to go get an honest burger. So Bronwyn has now gone. I'm absolutely awful of vlogging today, but so in one of those days we were just catching up with someone you haven't seen for like nearly a year. So it was just amazing to like see her and spend time with her. So um, I left her off just before we were about to go get burgers. I don't think I recorded anything from um, the food and stuff, but we just had these amazing burgers at Honest Burger. It was insane. I always love Honest Burger. It's one of mine and Annette's favorite spots. Um, yes, and I'm just walking back to Waterloo. Um, had the best day, as I say, the show was insane. If you get the chance, please go, 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 because it was incredible. It's due on for a bit longer, so make sure you go if you get the chance. Um, and as I say, go on to day ticks, because I got 25 pound tickets and I was in the fly zone. So it was insane, so, so good. Um, but yeah, so that is it for today's video. Please remember to like and subscribe, hit the bell to get notifications when I post, and I will see you again very soon for another video. Goodbye, guys.